didn't, that weren't here last year, which is what you're trying to do. You're just trying to get involvement and get. It's mainly for them. We get some good out of it. It's mainly for them so that they can uh, see some of their ex teammates, guys they played with, and get get together a little bit. You think it was harder for Coach McGroom to coach these guys now than it was uh, back in the day? Probably because he, he don't know many of these guys. There are a lot of new guys that were played after he he was coaching them. So. Uh, you know, we just uh, hopefully, you know, we swung the bats pretty good today. Hopefully, that's a sign of things to come. Uh, what is your forecast for the upcoming season? Well, hopefully, you know, if I had to say one thing, I hope we stay healthy. If we stay healthy, I think we'll be fine. We've got a very challenging schedule, and I keep repeating that, keep repeating that, but it's very true. And, and uh, we just got to keep everybody healthy and on the field. And if we can do that, uh, I like our chances. You got some very tough opponents coming up with Texas Tech, TCU, and the. Uh, Defending national champions, Coastal Carolina. What is the forecast on that for them? Well, and you forgot Lafayette. They're pretty good too. So yeah, it's uh, we can't worry about it. We got to worry about what we do. Uh, you know, we know we're going to play good people, and, and it just make, makes us practice a little harder and uh, bear down a little more because we know nothing's going to be easy. All right, appreciate your time. Thank you very much, Coach. All right, thank you, Coach. What does an event like this kind of mean to you to be able to get all these kids back? Well, I, it's fun. It, it, like I said, it's mainly for them. You know, uh, it gets them together with guys they played with. You know, in their era, uh, and it's for the young, a lot of the younger guys to come back. You know, get them connected a little bit before they move on and have families of their own.